Hello and welcome back. My name is Vanessa Blanc from Wild Woman Bushcraft. In this video I want to show you a simple but effective way to protect your property or your stuff, your forest cabin, what else. I show you a simple and low cost way to build yourself an alarm system which warns you if someone is coming to your house, to your property. I show you three different alarm um, signs to protect your home, your equipment, your stuff, which cost under 50 euros. So here are all my three different systems. This here is the cheapest one with under 2 euros. This here is the next step, which is very loud, 120 decibel. And this here is the loudest one and effectivest one. Um, this here is an automatic firecracker. Let's start with the automatic firecracker because I think this is the most effective way to protect your home, your equipment. Because all of these possibilities had contrast and pro sides. For example, just to tell you one, I have here the spells. And like you can hear, they are not so loud. So you have to be in a closed area around to hear this. But with this firecracker, you can be a little bit away. You will hear it almost because it is pretty loud. And you have also the possibility to uh, load different stuff inside. But I want to talk to you um, later more about that. So this here is very suitable for defense from your equipment, from your home. All you need is now at the table. So you need a um, wire or which is also possible is a fishing line and different cartridge. So these are nine millimeter blank cartridges. And this tool here, it is called Kiefele and it is an automatic firecracker. You had to um, pull the trigger and then it makes a loud bang. So the Kiefele works like this. Here is a hole and through this hole you put a wire or a fishing line. And when someone come to this uh, fishing line or to the uh, wire, there will be a movement here. And inside of the Kiefele is a firing mechanism. You can make it safe and you can make it sharp. And when it is sharp, uh, here inside is the cartridge. There's a blank cartridge. You just put it inside and when it is sharp and there is a movement, the cartridge will make a loud bang, it will fire. Very important, there are some rules when you want to work with this Kiefele. Um, I can tell you only the rules for Germany. The law in your country is different. So I want to talk about the situation, how it is here in Germany, but later after the praxis test. So I am now at my forest cabin and I walked around and I want to check out which place is where the most people come through my cabin. So in this year's this point. Um, of course, I fixed this only for this video and after the video I will remove it because like this it is not legal here in Germany. So it works. Simple. I have here my wire or a string or a fishing rope and I fix it close over the ground. And when someone come to the cabin, he doesn't see this wire so he will fall over it and this will start the shooting mechanism. So you can make a short distance with the wire or a long distance, or you can combine it with several of the kefalers. So you had to make the choice at your own. Inside of the kefaler is actual a slaughterhouse cartridge. And this works with 1200 bars, which is very massive. And also a blank cartridge works with 600 bars, it's also very high. And when I fix the kefalin now, I should make it very careful because I don't want to hurt anybody or kill somebody. I only want that the person who comes to my cabin have a shock moment and is afraid and runs away and I hear this noise. So 
I had to fix it this way that I don't kill a person or hurt a person. Because also blank cartridge could kill somebody when it is too close to their head. And I don't want to have something like this. I have fixed the system now. You can see I use here this green uh, rope. When you came closer you can see it, but when you are far away or have your eyes not at the ground you will not see it. So, when I installate this, it is very important that I have here this safety part down. Because if I can suddenly, here, suddenly here to this point, it could happen that I start the shooting without want it. So when I come now to this string, it will not shoot because the distance is here, because of the safety part. If I would not have it inside, this part here would be close here and the shoot will start which could be very dangerous. So, and I have here now the slaughterhouse cartridge and I just had to put it down, fix it, and then when somebody come, I had, um, of course, to make it first, the safety part here away, and then it is sharp and it will shoot. So now I had to be careful and work very, very safely because when I make it sharp now and I had my hands on the top of this shooting mechanism and I start accidentally the shooting, it would be very, very dangerous. So work slowly and with quiet hands. Shelf. I am now the victim or I am the bad person because I am now the robber. I want to robbery my forest cabin and harm the cabin. So I had to walk here now to my self-made construction and start the shoot. Wow, that was really impressive. 1200 bar, which are exploding at once, are really, really loud. And you must see the situation if there is a robber or someone who would harm you and come to your property and you hear suddenly this shoot you have a really shock moment. You don't know what happened here. Is there someone to protect their stuff? From where come the shooting? So, and this is what we want, this shock moment. And next we are testing black powder. There are different possibilities what you can load inside of the kifale. Uh, you can also load pepper patrons. I try it once by Jörg Sprave, Slingshot channel. channel. Um, I've got them as an accident in my hands and then in my eyes and it hurts really bad over hours. And when you have here this blowing um, pepper gas, you will have it everywhere and you are complete out of control. The next shoot is ready with black powder. So I doesn't try black powder before and I'm very looking forward how loud it is. The slaughterhouse pattern was very loud, so let's see. So the black powder was also very loud, but not so loud as the slaughterhouse um, cartridge. So I would prefer the slaughterhouse cartridge because it is louder and it makes more, it is more impressive. 
I want to show you at least by this system the cat ridges because you can see how different there is the pressure here at the cat ridges. So this here is the slaughterhouse cat ridge and this here the black powder and you can see how different they are open. So the slaughterhouse had here a red point that you can see which cat ridge it is and there is also um, wax on top because so this they dry and you can see how wide this is open and how wide this is open and then you can see how much pressure is behind. Other options to use the kefale are blank carriages and pepper ones which are really hurtful so you can use this cartridges into the self-defense pistol so there is no projectile shooting only the sound and for example the pepper this here is on Tsuraki in German the law said when you want to use and carry this self-defense weapon you have to have the small weapon card which allows you to carry this kind of weapons so the loud part is over now and we want to take a look to the other options. Another option to warn is this pocket alarm. So this is normally for women, they have it in their pockets and when there is a situation when they feel unsafe and they need help, they put it out. So there is a um, part which is going inside and when you open it, there is a very loud alarm. It is pretty loud, it hurts in the ears, it is our 120 decibels, which are pretty loud. And when you close it, it is silent again. And I will make a string where you can fall over it in combination with this pocket alarm, because this will also warn you when someone is coming. Of course, if this situation would be real, I want to fix it better and make their own protection for this part. Um, you can make it invisible. Or what I would do is fix the string very strong and put this part under the cabin. So if someone would come to my cabin and start the alarm, he could not put the string to stop very soon inside again because otherwise he could search for the two parts, stop it very close and that was it. But yeah, it is normally a pocket alarm, but for your home safety, very effective. And the best is it is not really expensive. You can really buy it for small money. Of course, I would put the link in the video description. The last one and the cheapest one is the bell alarm. You need just um, this metal string and some bells. I've bought this for under one dollar, so they are really cheap. You just had to fix the bells and fix the string around your camp or your house. And when the person come, they fall over this string and you will hear the bells ringing. Of course, this is really silent and when you are not close to your house you will not hear it and the second one it will not really bring the robber away from his idea to steal something from you so this is only a plus option but i would prefer not only have this one of course you could use also other stuff which makes noise like glass bottles or um, metal um, bottles, so everything what makes a noise, but the bigger it is, the more easier it is for the people to see it. In Germany it is very complicated who uh, is able to use the Kieferle and in which situations. So I don't know how the law is in your home country, so I don't want to talk about this because I don't know how it works in your country. When you use the Kieferle, you can use your creativity. That means that you can fix the Kieferle behind a window when a robber came and um, put the window out um, that uh, 
that he will hear the alarm or when you have a barn with expensive equipment that you put the kifale behind the door but you always had to check that the kifale is very well fixed but uh, you can see it before when I fix it at the tree I only have one fixing point of two which are able and when the shoot was coming the kefale was turning around and this could mean that the shooting point um, come to the person and if you don't want to hurt the person you always had to be sure that the open area is not in the direction of the person. I would use from this three systems the key filler because this is the most effective one and I could use different cartridges with it. So if I would be in the situation that I had to protect my home or my forest cabin, I would buy several of them and fix them around of the cabin because when someone is coming, this is the most effective way to make them in a shock situation and maybe they thought after this, oh, I should go away, I should run away from this property because this is dangerous there. So definitely I would use the Kiefele. Of course you could use all of these systems, but I would use always this one which is the most effective because when you, for example, build the bells um, alarm at first, the person would not run away because of this and you maybe it doesn't hear it. You would hear this if you are there, but if you are not there, the person thought maybe the other the settlements or other houses are too far away. It doesn't make sense, so I could rob anyway. But if you have the Kiefele or several of them, this is the most effective way because if I hear the shooting from several of them, I would definitely run away because I don't know what is coming at next and if there is someone really shoot at me. Of course, I hope I never come in the situation that I had to protect my home, that I need one of these alarm systems. But if the situation would come someday, I would prefer the Kiefele. This is my first um, choice because this is the most effective one. So all the products that I show you in this video are like every time down there in the video description you will find the product link there. So and if you like this video I'm very happy if you click subscribe and activate the bell to don't miss any of my videos. So I hope you like this video and we see us again in the next video. Be prepared or something else. We will see us. Have a great time. Bye bye.